this is Rosa Kelly welcome to a new crafty vlog so for today's vlog I'm gonna be sharing with you the projects that I have been working on like this week and some new collections I'm excited about also I'm gonna be taking you shopping with me because I went to visit my cousins and I discovered a Joanne's superstore so I definitely need it and to go in and share with you and um, so yeah super super excited so before we get into the vlog I do want to share with you a little collaboration that I'm doing with Vivor for this video and we're gonna be doing a little unboxing so they went ahead and sent me this huge box and this is a button maker machine and I am super excited because I have been wanting to create little buttons and just make them like kind of match the theme of the project project that I'm working on and I always see people do that and now I am like excited to give it a go so we're gonna be opening this huge box here together so this comes with all kinds of pieces and different size buttons so I guess I didn't know what I was expecting I thought I was gonna be making like the little small buttons but they literally sent or this package came with everything and so I'm gonna have to investigate how to use this but let's look at it together so they sent these little clip buttons so these are like the ones that if you make the buttons like you can clip them and that is so cute I'm taking the girls to Disney this summer and it will be super cute to create our own little like little Disney characters and like maybe pin them on their backpacks wouldn't that be so fun so I love that they come with these pieces here then they also come with the silver buttons and you can clip these on your backpacks or like if you have one of those um like the things that you hang and then you start putting all the charms around I don't know what it's called but the girls have one <laughs> and so it comes with a little pink so all you do is like add the image okay so that is gonna be super fun now these ones here are a little bit different these ones don't have like the clip but I I'm gonna have to figure it out I'm super excited it's a new hobby for me you know I'm all in and there are these a super huge plates as well and so i'm sorry this is gonna be shiny because of the you know the metallic disc and you get so many of each and then you also get the big size on the white these ones do have the clip not fun i mean i'm just thinking also when you do like school projects for the kids and you want to like kind of have that i mean i'm excited to come up with different ideas for these and then there's also the large one with the clip on the metallic so then you also have like this little clear plastic so i'm assuming you put it on top of the image after you are done so it has that like nice you know protective film in there so you get the same for two sizes um and okay i'm definitely gonna need these <laughs> the instructions and so okay perfect oh my gosh i love these instructions so they show you like all the parts and then like step by step picture tutorials i need the pictures uh to make the buttons oh my gosh i'm super excited you guys and then it shows you how to do like for each different kind they also send you this little book here it says mr panda welcome to mr mr panda's world and then this comes with some like of the images kind of like as a template maybe as an example so it has all kinds of different stickers i mean these are going to be so fun to create with any theme you can even make some buttons using like scrapbook paper right here is the actual device and i love how heavy it is because it feels super strong and it almost feels like industrial like not one of those plastic ones that you find at the craft store so these are the molds press so i guess you will put the image and then you press it i'm gonna have to definitely learn how to use these but how exciting is this and so it comes with all this gear okay so let's put that over to the side i'll definitely have to look at the instructions to start playing with my button maker but i don't know about you guys but i 
think this is gonna be a hit, especially with the girls now going to Disney, make all kinds of different uh, buttons. And also like I'm thinking of faces or pictures on the buttons and just kind of having them for like a first birthday. I don't know, I think it will be super, super fun. But anyway, so thank you so much to Vivor for sending me this button maker. I'm definitely gonna be making some projects with this and I'm gonna have the link down below so you guys can check it out. And now let's get right into the vlog. So today is Saturday. I'm visiting my cousins and I discovered that by their house there's a Joanne's Superstore. I've never been to a Joanne's Superstore so I'm definitely gonna go right in and I'm gonna take you with me so we can go explore and check it out. Also this past week I have been on a mission to find my heavyweight car stock. I'm having problems finding the black one. I did find tons of the white one, but I'm working on a new set of blank books. So I definitely wanted to do white and black. So we're also going to be hopefully finding a Michael. So I wanna go in and see if they have the black heavyweight car stock that I need. Um, but yeah, so right now, let's go into the Joanne's Superstore. Um, Super excited, so let's go. And I, I really wanna know, really wanna know if I let me figure out where the road goes. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground Searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Even if the sky is falling down
Hey guys, happy Sunday. So I wanted to share with you what I picked up yesterday from Michael's and the Joann's Superstore. Now I did not have enough time to finish exploring everything that Joann's had to offer. So I'm definitely going to come back, but that was just so fun. Let me show you what I got from Michael's. I have this really heavy bag. So I went ahead and picked up some just basic cardstock. Sorry about the glare. So I got the um, craft color cardstock because I am working on a project that I'm going to share with you in a minute. And then I really like these tones of greens. So this is always perfect for like complementary cardstock for different projects. So love these. And then I was lucky enough to find finally after this is probably like the fourth Michaels I visit. <laughs> finally found the black heavyweight cardstock that i was looking for sorry about the glare uh, so this is 110 pounds it's the one that i always use and for some reason i can't find it anywhere and these michaels only had two otherwise i would have bought more so i'm going to continue on my hunt <laughs> for this black heavyweight cardstock uh, hopefully they restock because the last time i was at the michaels near my house was probably about a week ago so anyway um, then i also picked up some yarn now ah, i forgot i had a coupon and i did not use my coupon because the yarn was not on sale so the coupon that i had was for non-sale items and i realized this after i pay and was in my card that i didn't use it but anyway it's fine so i got the bernat blanket Look how pretty I love this pink. So as you guys know, I'm really very into crocheting. So I am making a little collection of turtles. Um, and I'm just excited to like kind of play with different colors. And so look at this beautiful like silver color. And that is the color here. It's called silver. This one is tan pink. This one's Bernard Blanket. Uh, but this one is Loops and Threads. So this is, I think, the Michaels brand. And um, this one is silver yes and then i also picked up this other color by that same brand and this one is carmine rose and it's re it's like a really bright pink so i think these two color combinations are really cute kind of like the turtle that i have back there so then at joanne's the yarn was on sale so i went ahead and picked up big twist uh plush and this one is color i mean it's the color coconut so it's like a white but not really it's more like a cream color so it's super bright on the camera then i picked up this other one this one is called this one's lavender and it's just so soft so i'm gonna be making a lot of little plushy projects because i'm just really into crochet these days um, and then i also picked up dusty rose Look how pretty is this color. And this is the um, Big Twist, which is the Joann's brand for yarn. And then at Joann's, I also picked up these papers because they were on sale. Look how pretty these are. So I picked up the Floral Couture and the Vintage. And so, yeah, so that's what I picked up. And me and the girls are going to head out. And after that, we'll come back here and hopefully do a little bit of crafting. So... I'll see you in a little bit. Hey guys, so back at the craft room and I wanted to share with you what I have been working on this week. So first, this is and the project that I created for the live class. So this past Friday, I had a live class um, open to everyone here on YouTube and we created the kind of like a second version of this folio here. I made this folio some time ago and I just wanted to create something very simple like these and also with a lot of capacity uh, for pictures. So this is the one and this is the one that we created together on the live. And so I still need to like finish up decorating this book and I'm waiting on magnets. Uh, so I completely ran out of magnets. So I definitely need to get some magnets um, so I can finish this here. Also this week, I was slowly but surely uh, working on this beautiful almond here. Now this one is using the Steampunk Journey collection and this is by Scrap Boys and I just love, 
love how pretty this collection is it is very steampunk and it has a lot of different um, pretty features here so i'm just going to give you a quick quick look on to these pages there and so i am still as you can see working on this book i still need to finish decorating and adding uh, some different elements here and also i still need to work on the covers but both sides this is going to be a zigzag style album so both sides are finished um, so yeah, so this is what I was working during the week. So now I actually want to uh, see if I can work on the covers here next. So I'm going to put that on the side. And then also I have been working on these beautiful flower uh, books here. So you're going to see a little sneak peek of a collection that I'm creating. And so these are going to be journals and lab books that I'm going to be adding to my website. So I am excited to see this collection come together. So, so far I have the covers and I also do have like some of the pages because I was pre-cutting the papers yesterday, uh, but I was just doing that, <laughs> you know, as I was watching TV. So I wasn't really doing a lot of crafting yesterday. We had such a busy day. And so I want these flower books to be very eclectic. Uh, they're going to be a combination of journals and lab book style. And I'm also going to be adding a lot of like sewing details and stitches. And I'm going to be using some beautiful flower cardstock that I have and also um, using uh, some tea dye paper that I'm going to be doing here sometime soon. So I'm excited. I just love when I get ideas and work on little collections. They always um, I don't know, just keep me so inspired. And as I mentioned before, I'm also going to start working on a blank book um, batch. And so I'm going to be making kind of like the prototype what I'm going to be basing all the books on. I always like to create something different that I did the last time. Although I still have a lot of pre-pages uh, pre-cut from last order so I'll probably do some of those and then some new ones as well um, but anyway so right now I'm just gonna go ahead and get working on this book and I'll show you what we um, what we finish Okay, you guys so i just finished this book and i think this book just blew me away it is way beyond what i even intended to do and i'm just so happy so let me share with you look at this isn't this amazing and and look at that double cover and it's just so Pretty. I'm so in love with this. It's going to give you a quick sneak peek. And so I'm going to be now uh, finishing up the little details, like all the inside um, parts of it. And I just love, 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 love how these came out. And I'm excited to share this with you guys. So I'm going to be now kind of like working on uh, finishing up the inside of the pages like all the areas that are still black yeah there is a serious pop-up on this book look at this and it's double like both sides have the pop-up but 
anyway i am super happy with how this came out um i loved it i've been working on this book the entire week and i just love it and i'm just gonna be closing out the vlog right here but before i just wanted to give you a quick sneak peek of my newest digital collection for patreon so you can find this collection on patreon uh, but also i will be adding these to my website as a standalone and i just love it i think this is a beautiful collection Collection. It's called Harvest and I was picturing for this like a beautiful garden and I added these little puppies because this would be a really cute like little birthday book like boy's birthday or any birthday in general but look how adorable are these cute little dogs like this one right here like i had to make this and it was just super fun to play with this collection look at the little kitties uh, so again this collection comes with 20 pages or 22 pages and they're all different designs and of course we have the big design pages and you also have like the backgrounds which i'm going to share with you here in a minute the look how adorable i'm just in love with like the mushrooms the garden the vegetables and it's just so cute like if you have a little one at home that is like loves to do gardening with you this will be a really cute book for that um <laughs> or like a little boy's birthday i don't know i just keep thinking boy's birthday because i just went to my nephew's first birthday and this is super cute i'm making him a baby book but i think we also need like a one year um book like this with this collection so so cute so i love so these are the background um complimentary pages and then we also have these different backgrounds um and let me just quickly show you that one but my favorite ones are these ones because you can cut up around like the little animals and just kind of place them and make them move then i also have like the mushrooms by themselves this one here so cute i love the mushrooms just by themselves they're like a little a mini collection i think i'm gonna be adding these pages to my journal how pretty is that i'm so into mushrooms <laughs> and then of course some beautiful flowery backgrounds as well and so yeah i think that's the last one oh one more mushroom page so i had tons of fun creating this page again this is the uh patreon's rewards for the month of june and it will also be added to the website by itself and yeah can't wait to play with this so i hope you guys enjoy the vlog i hope that you enjoy spending like this last two days with me and doing a little bit of crafting just a little bit of life in general i want to thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one